Hello ladies and gentlemen, guys and ghouls, my name's Kevin and welcome to my channel, The Art of Horror. Today I'm just messing around in a program called Masterpiece VR, a virtual reality sculpting program. And I'll be trying to sculpt Venom, the Spider-Man villain. I still have a lot to learn with this sculpting program. It's not the easiest thing in the world to use. It's very intuitive in some ways and in others I have no idea what I'm doing. But nonetheless it's great fun and the result I get in the end I'm quite happy with. While it turns out a bit rough, it still turns out okay. The teeth in particular gave me a bit of trouble. I think I was trying to sculpt too small. Next time I try to have a sculpt, I'll do the model quite a bit larger and then I'll scale the entire model down. A trailer recently dropped for a new Marvel Comics film uh, based around the character Venom, called of course Venom. And while I'm not the biggest Marvel Comics fan, I do adore the Venom character design. I think he looks really cool. Tom Hardy has been cast in the role of Eddie Brock slash Venom. Venom first made his appearance in the comics as a supervillain, but has since become more of an anti-hero character. Venom is a symbiote, a sentient alien with a gooey, almost liquid-like form. As with real-world symbiotes, it requires a host, usually human, to bond with for its survival. After bonding, the symbiote endows its enhanced powers upon the host. When the Venom symbiote bonds with a human, that new dual life form refers to itself as Venom. The Venom symbiote's first known host was Spider-Man, who eventually separated himself from the creature when he discovered its true nature. The symbiote went on to merge with other hosts, most notably Eddie Brock, its second and most infamous host with whom it became Venom and one of Spider-Man's arch enemies. According to S.H.I.E.L.D. it is considered one of the greatest threats to humanity. I'm looking forward to seeing the new film and I really hope they don't botch it, as I find a lot of these Marvel films quite hit or miss. I really do like the Venom character and I really like Tom Hardy as an actor, and I've really enjoyed his body of work over the years. He's in a TV show called Taboo, which is actually really good, and you should check it out if you haven't seen it. It has uh, mystical elements combined with a bit of political intrigue, and can be quite brutal. I'm also looking forward to using Masterpiece VR a lot more in the future, as I really enjoy using it. And now that I've learned that I should do the sculpting a lot larger and scaling it down afterwards, I'm looking forward to using it again very soon. The models from this program can be converted to an actual mesh which you can use in programs like Blender or 3D Max, which then in turn can be imported into games or rendered into a movie. So it's kind of like having your own little monster factory. The new movie trailer for Venom dropped recently and if you haven't seen it you should have a look. If you enjoyed this video please feel free to hit that like button. If you are new to the channel and you'd like to see more videos like this from me please feel free to subscribe. If you'd like to see me create some artwork in virtual reality or draw you a picture, please leave me a request in the comments below and I'll do my best to get around to doing it. Feel free to comment below, I love hearing from you guys. Thank you all so much for watching. This has been Kevin for The Art of Horror. Until next time, it's goodbye from me.